That's enough. Done already? Looks like your heart can go on like that forever. Good. I don't want to have to go through this physical nonsense for five years. Well, let's hope not. There is one thing I need to talk to you about. Your blood work came in. You have an unusually elevated white cell count. What? Like leukemia? It's not likely I don't get sick. Are you on any medication? Nope. You have any allergies? No. Childhood illness? Asthma. When did that stop? The day I lost my hair. Is this going somewhere? If this were anywhere else, I'd order a battery of tests, but I do see a lot of this in Smallville. Why should Smallville be any different? Well, some say it's because the Luthicorp plant has contaminated the environment. I very much doubt that. Let's order those tests. Now, I want this to be special. What do you think about a three-tier birthday cake? Thanks for the lifeline. It's a math midterm. It's not like I pulled you out of a burning building. I still appreciate it. Lana? I just wanted to get your opinion on the balloons. Now, I think white always looks good. Works for me. OK. This whole birthday extravaganza has been pretty distracting. I don't know. Having a birthday party at Lexi's mansion seems pretty cool to me. Stopped being my party a long time ago. If it was up to me, it would be pizza and loud music with my friends. Did you tell Nell that? We've been through a lot the past few months. I figure I should give her this one. Lana, guess what? The scout called. <laughs> I just heard I got the tryout with Kansas State. That's incredible. Hey, congrats. I haven't said yes yet. They want me there on Saturday, but that's your big night. It's Nell's big night. I was just telling Clark it wasn't important. Yeah, scout's honor. I want you to go. Yeah, I'll catch up with you guys later. Clark, I'm telling you, this is good news for you. Kansas State gives Whitney a full scholarship and Lana gives him a tongue bath. How's that good news? Even I'm having a hard time following the skewed Ross logic. Lana's gonna be dateless for her own party. Hi, Pete. Jody? You look... Dinner? I was still looking for a euphemism, but yeah. Are you okay? Never better. My diet's just starting to pay off. I bought some new clothes. <laughs> you look great. Thank you for sticking up for me yesterday. Most people wouldn't have done that. Most people can't stand Dustin. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, I was wondering, do you have a date for Lana's party? No, he's still free. Would you like to go with me? He'd love to. Great. Hey, folks. I'll see you later. Bye. I don't get it. Women dig me. Be used to it. No. I mean, Jody, it's like she lost that weight overnight. If she could do that, half the school would be after that secret. Well, let's go. 